Now, in this presentation, what we are going to do is get a map or make a map based on a GPS coordinate. So what I'm going to do here is I am going to pick out a, a bar I like in London. So this is in London, UK. It's called the French House and it is in the middle of Soho, not far from Piccadilly Circus and it is a great place to go on april the first if you're there on april the first or thereabouts you will see me there probably now so that is the gps coordinates and the what we want to do is actually make a map now so essentially what i'm going to do is actually work backwards okay so the geocode that just came from uh, I, had, I had a different presentation so what i'm going to do actually is what we're going to do here is make a location based on that those coordinates okay so I'm just going to turn that into a little vector and there we go now this is something to watch out for longitude latitude is the way it's given here okay now if you were to actually look at Google Maps you actually might sort of see the latitude first then the longitude okay watch out for that okay I'm going to sort of work on the basis I given I'm just taking it as it's given to me okay and we'll anticipate that being a problem later on okay so that is the location now okay let's just say that's my starting point that this is our location and what I want to do is get a map and so on so there's a couple of things I've got to do here so essentially what I'm going to do is my French house map FH map okay so the first thing I'm going to use is the command get map okay then I'm going to state my location now the location is the location given there okay our location is my location I should have called that my location and location equals my location anyway not to worry so source equals what type of map will we go for we'll go for a Google map now I'll show a couple of the other examples here but I'll just go for the default one here first off uh, what we might do is the zoom level uh, is 14. Essentially what I'm going to do is put in all these settings here and just sort of adjust them. So the zoom level is 14 and the map type equals satellite. Just going off the screen there. So zoom must be a whole number between... Okay, sorry, I put this in... Bra I actually put the, accidentally put that in quotation marks and I shouldn't have. So let's put that... There we go. I misspelled satellite as well. Have I? Two L's. Now, that should work. Okay, so uh, essentially what I'm going to do is just give it a second there. Essentially what I'm going to do is... There we go, map from URL. It's just ready to go. And to now we are going to depict it. GG map. My... French house map. There we go. Pops up there just like that. Now, the zoom level, okay, so it's not centered or anything like that. And it, it, we, we could actually put, essentially, I'm going to do this another time, but essentially, what I'm going to do here is uh, in later on, we're going to put um, a little dot in there, but I'm not going to do that justice yet. Essentially, what I'm going to do is just switch that out, and we're just going to have a look at, so cancel that. Oops, I'm not canceling the whole thing. Just cancel that. Switch that down. Let's try out a different one or a different zoom level. So it says we can go into zoom level 21. So let's just go to 19 first off. Okay, zoom level 19. And let's give that a second. It seems that we're ready to go. Uh, let's go. Sorry, I'm going to rerun that bit of code and let's gg map my french house map and let's see what the zooming is like ah that's actually almost too good now so um it's sort of depicted there but anyway so essentially what we can do is just blow that up actually a little bit so that's actually a google image a satellite image okay so let's sort of let's t try a different type of map so we've seen there earlier on that we could have a terrain map let's utilize my deliberate error 
my it wasn't a deliberate error it was a actual spelling mistake but what we're going to do here now is see what it looks like in other types of map so essentially what we could do here is uh, we could adjust the zoom level so 14 is really really far out okay uh, 19 is probably a little bit too close but we'll just stick with that for the time being we probably 16 17 or 18 just to sort of what might be all right for including local landmarks uh, just give it a second there now they, they, these are you're dealing with a lot of data here so it actually is well you know satellite imagery you know this is quite high-end high stuff uh, I think we have a map here and just actually just close this down and see what we have in the background I probably should, like, there we go. That, no, I just need to close that down. Let's run that again. Oh, no, sorry. GG map. Sorry, I'm just uh, losing my thread. Now, there we go. So, that it is. Th there it is there. Now, this is, uh, we get the, the street names here. Romilly Street, Dean Street, Old Compton Street, and so on. Okay. So, um... Yeah, that's grand. So you might be able to zoom out again. I don't know. So let's close that down, minimize that, and let's just sort of see. It, we there's actually other sources, like of uh, map as well. So it's not just Google. Uh, let's have a look at another one. So Google has this uh, thing with the APIs, and that it could be a problem. So I'm actually going to sort of deliberately misspell Google, so it just sort of doesn't know what's going on. So we got OSM, Stamen, and CloudMate. So let's just try one of them. I'll just the zoom level down to 16, probably just get in the local um, OpenStreetMap as OSM. Let's have a look at that. Uh, okay, a little error message there. I'll tell you, we'll come back to that, but essentially...